right now Oz here and we are going back to some basics there's a lot of cool stuff in Excel right now and it just keeps coming right but we can't forget the people who are just learning Excel and trying to come along we got to go back and show them some basics and some of us, when we start getting excited about the new stuff and the fancy stuff, we get too big for our britches. In this video, we're gonna go back, get reminded of sorting and how it works, it's powerful. And when I first started using Excel, I had sort, filter, and if and a mouse to drag cells around. And I went so far with those, we can't forget them. Here is some data. We've got IDs, the attendees, the sessions that they're assigned to, and the status about if they're coming, if they're not. And then we see Lizette, there's a blank for status because we haven't heard from Lizette yet. It is easy to sort by the attendees let's say go to data and let's sort but here is one issue if we want to sort by session so that we have the fall people all together the winter people all together that's easy but the problem is that's going to be out of order we want to see fall and then winter and then spring and then summer. But let's go ahead and do this. Boom. Everybody in fall and then spring. That makes no sense because what winter is between fall and spring. Here is what we have to do to make this available to us. I'm going to go to sort. And then, yep, session is there, sort order, go over here, custom list, look at that. I'm gonna add, and then I'm gonna go, how, how do I want this order to be? I want it to start with fall. Fall, and then comma, space, winter, comma, space, spring, comma, space, summer. Good. Add it, look at that, it's right there in lists available to us, along with if we had Sun, Mon, 2, or Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, etc., Jan, Feb, etc. We have months and days. Now we have seasons available to us. Let's click OK and OK, and now click Sort, Sort Sessions. All right, so that is selected. And then let's add a level. Go to, say, attendees. Sort A to Z and OK. Look at that. Now we can easily see we have three people signed up for winter and one of them, Zinnia, has already said that she's not coming. Now let's go to something else. Look at zodiac signs. We've got our list of friends. So Pavo is a Taurus. Let's check that out. Yep, that symbol is a Taurus. But now we want to sort by these icons. That can be a challenge because you can't go into that sort where we added the custom sort. We can't paste into there. But you see what we want to do though. We would like to get whatever this symbol is, want to see that it's this is a cancer. We want to get cancer over here, but we also want to sort by the icons. So let me do an X lookup on these icons. Equals X lookup. Double click, look up value and comma, look them up here, comma, 
return what? Return the sign and enter. Good. Now we have everybody sign Aquarius, Leo, Libra. But we can't sort in the order that we want. Here is how we do it. File. Options. Advanced. Go down to general. Edit custom list. This arrow. These are the entries we want. Import. Look at that. They are in there. Click OK. OK. Now let's sort for real. Sort. I'm going to add a level because I want to sort the friends names A to Z. But first, I want to sort the icons by the custom list. Grab that. OK and OK. <laughs> Beautiful. Now we can see we have three Aries. We've got eight Cancers, etc., etc. Hold on. There's one thing I forgot to tell you about. Once you have set up a custom sort, it is set up in Windows, not in Excel. And that means you still have those custom options available no matter what workbook you open on this specific computer. If you take the file and open it in another computer, all bets are off. But let me show you. I am in my random data generating workbook and I'm in a data tab and I'm gonna go to sort. I'm going to go to custom list and there are the custom sorts that I created. And if I don't need them anymore, I can highlight and delete. There's your reminder about being able to do a custom sort. And for those of you who haven't seen it, hopefully this will be useful to you. We can't get too far from our foundation while we enjoy the fancy stuff.